Hello everyone, it's Mrs. Moran, and I am here to solve a couple of the problems that you had in your exit ticket yesterday. And I'm gonna show you how I would solve them. Stop the video at any point to let yourself understand it even more. Um, maybe even practice a couple other problems. This is a multi-step uh, process. So it's gonna take you a little while and that's okay because Anything worth doing might take a little bit. So the first problem that we had you solve on your exit ticket was four and one third times five and two thirds. The first thing that you're gonna to wanna to do to multiply these two mixed numbers is you're going to want to make them into improper fractions. Now, could you multiply using them? Sure. But you're going to have to make sure that you do four different problems if you do that. So what we're teaching you to do is just change them into improper fractions. Four and one third is four times three is 12 plus one is 13. That's equal to 13 thirds and five and two thirds is 15 plus two is 17 thirds. I wish that this was a problem that I could cross reduce, but I can't. So I'm gonna have to multiply 13 times 17. Three times seven is 21, drop the two, er, drop the one, carry the two. Seven times one is seven, plus two is nine. Zero is a placeholder, I'm moving over to the next place. One times three is three, and one times one is one. I'm gonna add these all together, I'm gonna to combine my work, and the top of this numerator is 221 over nine. Three times three is nine. I now have a new fraction, it's improper. We never want to leave our fractions improper. So this is what I was saying. It's a multi-step problem and that's okay. We're just going to take the time to do it. Next, I'm going to divide 221 divided by nine. So let's see, nine into 22. Nine can go in two whole times without going over. And I got as close as 18. I'm gonna find the difference, ooh, four away. I'm then gonna bring down the one to continue my work. 41 divided by nine, let's see, I think I can get as close as 36, which is nine times four. I got as close as five away. Now here's where you have an option. You can do this a couple different ways. You could either report your answer um, as 24, with a remainder of five. Hmm. That seems like so long ago we reported answers like that. It works. You could also report your answer as a mixed number with a fraction. It's out of nine, so it's 24 and five ninths. Or if you really wanted to show off what you can do, you could continue the decimal. So let's see, that's nine into 50 is Five whole times, that's 45. Oh no, I'm running out of room. Oh, good. I'm getting a repeat. So you could also say your answer is 24 with five repeated. That is problem number one. Three different ways to report the same answer. This problem took one step to change it to improper, two steps to multiply those large numbers that we had to do on the side, three steps to divide, and then our fourth step to report it as an answer.